Over the last 10 years, me and Emma have concentrated on bidding. Hang on. I'm going to do it. Been the best parents that we could be. We didn't really socialise with anybody, didn't me and Emma. We just brought our kids up and we did what we did for our children. We give them the best life we can and we still do. But we've, we've now, we've got an amazing group of friends, look at you all here, to celebrate our day. It's amazing, so I thank you all. I can't believe it, I'm, I'm honoured to have you all here, I really am. I couldn't be prouder of Emma and Stephen for bringing today. And Emma has massively, massively changed Stephen. Because he was a little bugger. Everyone knows he was a bugger. He's, much, he's, he's a family man. His family always come first. He works hard for what he's done. They're both my best friends. And these two together all work amazing. They have done for the last 11 years. And it's been 10 years since they said they were getting married. And they're still in love, still idolise each other. I'm just so proud of you both. I know this is the real thing and I know it's it's just a match made in heaven and I could ask for a better son in law. Not one better son in law in this world. From me and Dawn, we love you both. And from the family, we love you. And it's just good that two families have come together and we all get on. And it's gonna be absolutely great and it's just gonna be one big journey. Stephen and Emma, I invite you now to join hands and to make your vows in the presence of God and his people. I, Stephen, take you, Emma. I, Stephen, take you, Emma. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death us do part. Till death us do part. According to God's holy law. According to God's holy law. In the presence of God, I make this vow. In the presence of God, I make this vow. I, Emma, take you, Stephen. I, Emma, take you, Stephen. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, can I ask you to be upstanding, raise a glass and go crazy for the new Mr and Mrs Thompson. She's been like a mother all her life. When John and Declan was younger and that, she used to have on her, on her hips and walk around with her. She's got the kindest heart uh, I know. She's so beautiful. All I know is that her life, she's given so much joy, so much happiness, and so much care. When I walked her down that aisle today, I thought I could hold the tears back. But, oh, I, I can honestly say Steve is one of the best lads I know and still is to this day my role model. He has not pushed me to get my career, he's posi positively influenced me not to be filled with greed and selfishness, but shaped the man I am today. He taught me how to succeed in life, and I think he, he's, he started my career. He's, he's done everything for me, he's taught me everything. Me and Emma have done things what I call the modern way. He's given me the most amazing, beautiful, three children a man could ask for. Emma, you support me on every decision I have made for our family. I'm going to end this on Emma. You're my rock, my world, my everything. And I love you with my whole heart. And I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Got that.
trials on me I could never explain What's going to say when we don't care of them at all. 